So this is the area you guys see behind me while I'm filming. This is where all my makeup stored, where a majority of it. These Alex drawers, it's a funny story you guys. Before I started making YouTube videos, Dual Say Candy, this was like years ago, maybe like, oh my gosh, like a long time ago when she first started. She's the one who started these Alex drawers. I wanted them so bad because of her and this was before I even had a lot of makeup. But they are really good at, for organizing your makeup and other things if you have like a lot of products you want to have because they have larger drawers at the bottom. But I saved up like 175 or 125 for these drawers. The table is also from Ikea. I'll leave the links and names to both of these. They're not the same, like in the same family because Ikea always has like different names for different types of furniture. This desk is, well it's actually a desk, but this is my vanity slash desk that I use. And then this is just a bed side table. I'm going to show you guys where everything's from even though I don't use the side table to organize makeup. So I'm just going to start from this side and then my work myself to the right showing you guys where everything's from. So this side mirrored table furniture thing. Mirrored furniture is super expensive. If you guys go to Z Gallery, West Elm, if you look online, it's super expensive. I'm not sure why because it's just literally glass. But this I got for like $75 or $100, which this would probably be like $200, $275. I saw super expensive stuff even at living spaces where it's a little more affordable. But this I actually got more of a discount just because it was a little ruined well a lot of ruined there was a few scuffs and stuff on it so I got it for cheaper than the actual price and I don't store any makeup in any of these drawers I want to but I'm in the midst of organizing my closet not how I want to have it organized but that's what it is now this picture frame is from Marshalls I believe this cute jewelry box which was my favorite out of everything when I was redoing my room is by Nicole Miller and this was from Marshalls and it's $12.99. I never took the tag off. These flowers are from the Dollar Tree as well as the glass vase. Now for my vanity area, these, everything, it was super inexpensive, super cheap. Everything on this, in this area was pretty much a dollar or under $10. This was from Target, it's actually a candle holder. I didn't realize when I bought them that they were two different silvers. This is, you can kind of tell. I don't know. I didn't notice till after and they were right next to each other, but I bought them separately. I had only bought one and then I was like, oh, I need another one. So this, the, those two, they were candle holders from Target. These little white containers were candle, I believe they were, they were like for, they were in the garden section at Ikea. And I think they were like three or four dollars. This was a vase from the dollar store, Dollar Tree. This mirror, it turns on, it's not plugged in. I don't really use it, it's more for show. I used to use it. The mirror I actually used to film is below my desk. But I believe my mom got it at GTM. It's a discount store here where I live. I think she got this for a really good deal for like twenty dollars and I think they retail for like a hundred. Now for my plastic organizers, they're both from the dollar store but I want to be specific just in case you don't have either dollar store wherever you live but I'm sure you do. These top ones, these three ones, they're just, they're just stacked on top of each other. These top three were from the Dollar Tree and then these two bottom ones which are bigger because there's only two these were from the 90 First drawer, I just have lip liners. I don't really use too many of these. I tried to get creative when I do my videos, so I should start using more of them. This second drawer is just eyeliners, brow products, gel liner, nothing too much. I don't really wear eyeliner anymore because I have tiny little eyes, and this is some glitter liner. In the next drawer, I just have a few lipsticks, some old contacts that need to go in the trash. In this drawer, I have a few lashes. Th these are literally all the lashes I have right now, you guys. I normally buy packs of lashes on eBay, but I haven't gotten around to it. The last drawer is all well, some of my concealers. These are all just concealers I can reach to. This is my 
vanity slash desk. All this makeup is makeup I use pretty much on the daily. Not all of it, but I can't, I don't have room for it anywhere else. So these are a majority of the products I use every day. Sometimes I try to switch it up. I normally keep cotton pads and q-tips here. I have to re-stack it though. But these are just, this drawer is not organized at all. For the Alex drawers on top of here, I just have jewelry. I don't really wear a lot of jewelry. These tiny thin chokers are what I wear most. But I used to love wearing like, this one's really cute. I bought this off a friend off Instagram. I'll leave her link below. This is so pretty and it was really, really, really good quality. I didn't think it was going to be as good quality as it was. This little organizer, necklace, jewelry organizer was from Ross. This cup, I got at Ross. And I just keep my beauty blenders in here because I don't have room for them anywhere else. This born to shop, for, forced to work. This is so cute. This was from Ross too. I just keep it up here because I don't have, I don't like hanging stuff up. This little camera I got from Best Buy. It's one of those Polaroid instant cameras. These coasters, I believe, were from Marshalls. This little thing, I don't know what it says underneath. Oh, it says, be happy always. This was a, in the dollar section at Target. Open this drawer. These are all my lipstick. It goes further back, but you can't really see it. I don't wear lipstick at all anymore, you guys, but I have so many of them. I need to try to start wearing lipstick more. I'm more into lip stains and lip gloss than lipstick, but these are all my lipsticks. These are some vitamins I was supposed to take because I have a really bad immune system. This is Forever 21 brush I've never opened. Um, these, these are something, this is something I got from Lush just recently. Oh, more lashes I forgot I had, actually. Translucent powder. These are pictures of me and my best friend when we went to Seattle. This drawer is just a mess. I never go in it. Now in this drawer, these little organizers, I forgot to mention, that were in my desk drawer as well. These are all from Walmart and the dollar store. This organizer, this lipstick plastic organizer, I'm, was from either Marshalls or Ross as well as this one down here. And everything is so unorganized because I don't really dip into these drawers. I mean, I look into them every once in a while, which sucks because this is like a brand new highlight. This highlight is beautiful. I got it. It was Urban Decay Highlight in Sin. I never use any of this stuff. I need to start using, like, going through and actually trying to be creative with my makeup looks. So... I tried to keep this as organized as possible, but it's, you can see it's not as organized because I don't have enough room. Not until I clean out these bottom drawers in these Alex drawers, but I'll, you'll see why. So pretty much these are eyeshadows. I don't really wear a lot of eyeshadow, but these are like my loose individual eyeshadows and pigments. I try to keep, I try to organize this as, this drawer as highlights and bronzers. These are some foundations, another eyeshadow palette. These are all my foundations that I have, some of them, and primers. Um, lip glosses and lip products, just, I try to put all my lip glosses here. More highlights back here. This next drawer is blushes, more lip, oh, more eyeshadows back here. More blushes and eye, yeah, blushes. These are blushes, powders, these are more bronzers and powders, concealer palette, nothing's really organized in these drawers, I tried you guys, but I just don't have enough room yet until I clean out my closet, or I need to just clean out this makeup. Primer, blushes, then in this next drawer, this next drawer is literally just a mess. It's a bunch of jewelry. I actually don't wear any of this jewelry. The only jewelry I wear is this Mega Kors watch, and I haven't worn it in forever. But I have watches, jewelry, I don't know what's in here. Let's see, a lens that I got that I don't know how to use that's in here. Some little travel size makeup wipes and stuff from Sephora. A pair of sunglasses that don't fit where they're supposed to go. These are dollar pigments I got off the Wish app. You guys heard of that on Pandora. 
more little travel size things. I don't wear any of this. I really need to get rid of some of it. But I just like, it's so cute. I'm just like, maybe I'll wear it someday or accessorize. I don't really accessorize too much except for necklaces. This pretty much is where the makeup ends. This is why I'm telling you I need to clean out my closet so I can put this stuff somewhere else in my closet because then I can use this extra drawer for makeup. These are just all my heat tools. I have like bobby pins and little hair ties in here. I have hairspray, my heat protectant, and then this is my like face masks and more of like my makeup remover and these are all my face products. I like these bigger drawers down here for the face products. This bin thing was from Walmart, Walmart as well. This drawer, this is more face products and lotions. No, this is actually more lotions and t self tanning and this is when I had blonde hair. Um, stuff like body stuff. This I, that's why I really like these drawers because look at all the stuff that I fit in here. I mean, it doesn't look super nice, but it's super convenient when you can just open it and grab it. Drawers are my bras and stuff. These are, this is some, um, I love this stuff. There's this lady at my local, what is it called? Farmer's Market that makes this. This is, a uh, shea butter? Yeah, the, I think that's what this is, this is shea butter. Um, this is, I just use this for my bras and stuff, and then these extra for these cotton pads, and then my underwear is in this last drawer. But I want to use these drawers for my makeup because you guys see how unorganized these drawers are. I don't really even go in any of these drawers. I mainly only use this drawer. Now if you go over here, this is where my TV is, and this is my drawer stand. I used to have the longer one, but I gave it to my mom and dad, and I ended up buying this one, because this one, even though this one has less drawers, I gave away a lot of clothes, and I figured if I, instead of having, because this only has four drawers, instead of having six drawers, I'll be less likely to buy clothes, and I don't need six drawers. So that's why I ended up getting this one. I missed the other one, because I like the way it looked, but this one is smaller, and it fits better in my room. That's my ring light. These are my perfumes. This is a jewelry box my aunt got me, and I just keep more sunglasses in here. Breakfast at Tiffany's. I love Audrey Hepburn. This is a fake book that I keep my, like, what should I call it? My computer stuff in, so like my cords and stuff. I keep in here. It opens up. I'm not going to open it for you guys. My journal. My best friend bought me this book. And then this is the last of my makeup. These are just highlighting palettes. All my palettes in here. I got this little basket at Target in the dollar section. I don't really come over here and use my palette. Well, sometimes, depending on how I'm feeling or where I'm going. I want the new Carly Bible palette, but these are just all my palettes I have. Some of these palettes I don't even use, like this, this e.l.f. palette probably needs to go in the trash. My Morphe palette's my favorite. I have another, like, this is a Shawnee concealer palette. This is a the 120 palette everybody freaking had back in the day. My contouring palette. Anastasia. These are all my palettes, so. The Glow Kit palettes, these are my favorite. These are all my palettes. I have another one of these stored in my closet somewhere used for nail polish, but I, I really liked this for my palettes. 